Hello, this is uh, Android tutorial number two. This is how to launch an activity from within another activity. So we're gonna create a base activity with a little button that's gonna launch our other activity. And we've already got the code written, so I'm gonna go ahead and launch it and let you see the results first. And then we're gonna go in and explain a little bit about what's in the code. So there's my droid and you can see it's running. And there it launches the activity. Tutorial 2. Hit the button launch activity. Activity 2 has been launched. Now if I go hit my back button, I'm back to the other activity. Launch activity. Activity 2 has been launched. So now let's go into what is in our tutorial. This is basically the starting tutorial, the hello world one. And starting from that, I created uh, tutorial 2 as my base Java class. I added in a button call uh, and then a click listener and then an on click uh, method uh, for that listener and that calls and launches activity 2. Here's the code for activity 2. Pretty basic stuff. It uh, is just basically the default content for an activity. Uh, the only difference is that the layout calls activity uh, layout number 2. And we'll see that down here under layouts. This is layout for activity two. All it has is a text view, the content of which activity two has been launched. Here's our main. And you see the main uh, XML layout just has a button. The button's ID is at plus ID button simple. This is so Android can find the resource and the ID uh, is button simple, BTN simple. And the text for that button is launch activity two. And we have wrap content for uh, layout width and height. That just tells the uh, layout inflator um, function to uh, make the object as big as it needs to to contain the content we said. So the only other couple of things you need to have uh, in order for this thing to work is in the manifest inside our application, you've got a second activity. It's activity dot activity two. And that's contained in the manifest file so that the Android operating system can find that other activity. So it knows that activity is in here. When it is called by the Tutorial 2 class. So back to this uh, Tutorial 2 uh, class in the on create, create, we've got the button simple. We find the button, then we take that button, give it a listener method. This listener method then tells the uh, Android operating system to listen for click events and says if you find a click event then launch this intent. We'll go into what an intent is later. Uh, basically uh, all you need to know is that that will launch uh, activity 2 and then start the activity for this intent. And that's pretty much it. I uh, hope you enjoyed this one and I'll have another one for you soon.